Coach, new season is here. Uh, just a, I'm sure exciting to have seven newcomers into this program, get your second season underway. What's the excitement level right now with this team? It's really high. I, I mean, it's extremely high. The energy's been really good. I mean, it's, it's a whole new deal for us. Uh, you know, you can feel it every day when we come in the gym, and and uh, and, and honestly, I mean, we felt it in recruiting, and, and we felt it with last year's team. Uh, didn't show in the win, win column, but you know, we certainly can feel the change, uh, change in talent on the floor, and and change in energy, and uh, and and just competitiveness, uh, day in and day out. As far as your returners, you've got a group led by Garibet Self, and just a sophomore with the reigning freshman of the year. Just how much does it help to have at least half this team that knows what you expect day in and day out with this program? Makes all the difference. It, it makes all the difference when you've got, you know, a point guard coming back that uh, that certainly knows what you want. Uh, you know, and of course you you also have a kid in Kiara Brimsey, you know, who sat and, and watched everything last year and. And she, she knows, too, you know, what we expect uh, as a leader, a, a veteran kid on the floor from the perimeter. So, you know, you got a, a couple young ladies that now know, you know, what we expect, what our standards are, uh, the level of competition that we would like to bring day in and day out. As you look at this team, I guess, who maybe stands out amongst the returners as far as uh, people in watch for? Well, early on, you know, there's no question, you know, Garibeth Self, you know, it, it certainly looks really good. Uh, and uh, Diamond Brooks has, has done a great job uh, in the paint. And, and uh, we're certainly excited about, you know, those guys. And uh, I think Whitney Goings has worked as hard as anybody uh, during the, you know, the, the summer months and, and into the preseason. So uh, we're just we're excited about that group. I think everybody, honestly, has probably gotten better. Uh, and then you add in the newcomers. So we're excited about those guys, you know, mixing in with some new energy. To have this group of newcomers, I know they've gotten to know each other through social media and, and what, what, whatever you have, you know, for technology these days. Just to, what kind of chemistry, how, how have they been able to tie into the chemistry and, and with this team that you have going right now? Well, I, you know, it's honestly been somewhat of a, a you know, an immediate chemistry, uh, you know, off the court and, you know, I think on, you know, we, we've, we're starting to see some of those things evolve. Uh, you know, the first first few days, uh, you know, were some of the first of having contact. You know, we, we've done a lot of fundamentals, a lot of drills, and uh, and just starting to do some uh, some some contact uh, things. And so, you know, we're starting to see some chemistry evolve on the floor, and boy, that's really exciting. To mention, you know, have to go through everything with COVID and all that. You mentioned just being able to have that contact. How challenging has this offseason been to get to this point? It, you know, it's, it's been challenging. There's no question about it. And I, you know, I have to say, hats off to our kids. I think they've done a tremendous job of handling the adversity, handling the constant change. And uh, you know, I, I just think we've all gotten better, stronger, uh, and and certainly more patient. Uh, and, and learned a lot, maybe a lot of qualities that we didn't think we had. Uh, you know, I think we've all gotten better from it and we're seeing that now.